Hey guys, time to chill out with Sub-07 and welcome back to Let's Play Battletoads. In the last episode, we got through the first four stages of the game, roughly one third of the entire game complete. And in this episode, we're going to be tackling stage five, the Surf and Safar. Ready? I'm not. <laughs> I have had like zero practice since the last time I did this. So let's see how this goes. Basically, this is the same thing as Turbo Tunnels, but it's two hit death instead of one hit death. See? Because only half my life is taken this time instead of all of it this time. Oh god. Gotta dodge the logs. Oh, good. Now this is much harder than it looks, actually. It doesn't look that bad, but believe me, this, get, this gets much harder later on. Like, the points where it's kind of ridiculous. I'm not doing that bad. No, I'm doing terrible. What am I saying? I'm doing terribly right now. Hey, face invaders, you're not allowed to take my points. I need my life. And, or not, apparently. Oh, it's one of these guys again. Eh. Eh. Hey. Stupid thing. I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna break with it. <laughs> don't make an inside joke about that. Because I don't know how it would feel if you were using my quotes like that. Just, just don't quote me, okay? Don't quote me, ever. Oh yeah, you can break the sticks as well. I didn't know that. Oh, boss, boss, boss. Good gut. Ow. Dead. <laughs> I got dead. Great word choice. Now here's the funny thing about this boss. If you do him correctly, you can be pretty, pretty freaking good at this game. Yeah, what am I trying to say? Ow. No. Bad. Yeah. Finally. Wait for him to jump. Oh, come on! Frickin'. Take that. Take that. Here's what I meant. Or not, apparently. Ow. Hit again. This is what I meant. If you can hit him in the right... If you can get him into a corner, you can combo him into oblivion. Sadly, it appears as though I cannot combo for the life of me. Oh, here we go. I got it. Are you proud of me, Mom? Mom! I don't think my mom's here. I'm sad now. Now I don't have anyone to praise my battle toadsness. I don't, I don't know. Eh. 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 Stay in the air, you stupid pig! Gotcha! That's how you do it. Okay, here we go. Servants of Far, second part. This is the worst part. Oh, random landmine. Literally. These mines are randomized where they will appear. Sometimes you can get completely screwed up. Oh, and they're permakill and they're insta-kill if they hit you, by the way. Oh god. Oh god. Yee. Ooh. And one up. Probably wasn't worth it. It probably was not at all worth it. Oh. Oh god. Come on. And sorry about the ba the bad quality of the video last time. I don't know what caused it. I tried turning down my, my other stuff, but I don't know if that'll do it. But stage five is cleared. What? You've made it through. I'll make you pay for your impudence. Watch out, toads. Sensors indicate something long and slippery slithering towards you. Yeah, my huge fear. I mean, a carnage lair. Snake level. This is where the second mega warp is that I use in this game. And I completely botched it up, but who cares? I fixed it. You can climb these snakes by walk by grabbing onto their sides when they're going vertical. By jumping on them. And you can just run on them. Now, the mega warp is in the second room of this area. There's four rooms in total. But I highly de recommend that you do not ever consider taking th the path of just clearing the stage. Believe me, this stage gets evil. And next room. There we go. Okay. Hump that snake and go down. Yes! Second Mega Warp. On to stage eight. I can't believe you've gotten this far. Prepare yourselves for a sticky green end, toadies. 
You toads are definitely moving up in the world. He means that quite literally. Stage 8, Intruder Excluder, the elevator shaft. Basically, all we need to do, not die. Those electric shooter guys, I'll explain what they can do in a minute once I get hit by one of them. Because I promise you, that's going to happen at least once. Got it? Now, this is where the game starts to get really hard. Like, not just Turbo Tunnels hard, but really hard. Ow. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> I'm just gonna take this again. The funny thing about this, though, is that you can get, like, really high scores by just pounding on those enemies with instant kill attacks. If you use a stick, it, it isn't that many points, but if you, like, use an instant kill like the ram horns or the foot, you instantly get 2,000 points. Oh. Take that while I can. And run up. Here's where things start to get kind of mean. These things. Oh. Jump up. Jump up. Boing. Boing. Uh-oh. Got it. Hmm. Wait, what? I was ducking. Oh, and the goop. I hate the goop. Oh, remember to fear the goop. This goop is evil. And so is death. <laughs> Didn't even die by the goop. Just freaking... Died by the... Pfft, died by being stupid. Just like that. Oops. Zap, 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 zap. Oh, I'm through. Boing. Boing. Got it. Ugh, again. I hate that jump. That one jump spot is really annoying because you can always get stuck on it. Oh. There. No hits that time. Good. Yeah, once you start to memorize the stage layout, it really starts to get easier until you get to the harder parts. Because I'm not even at the second checkpoint yet. At least I don't think I am. And if, and if I am, then I mean the third checkpoint. Punch. There we go. Darn it! Ah, second jump always messes me up as well. Yeah, if you couldn't tell, this is one of my least favorite stages in the game. Like, I'm not saying the four after it are any better, but this stage... Ah, uh, vertical drops always cause, cause migraines. Oh, got it. Come on. Ow. What? I was ducking! Oh, wait, I remember. That one is in a very tight spot, and it's so low to the ground that it basically is hits you even if you're ducking. And that was just stupid of me. I seem to be saying that word quite a lot in this so far. I will get this. I promise I will get this. Eventually. Now, when is up to a matter of principle. So how are you guys doing? I'm just climbing up an elevator shaft trying not to get electrocuted and being a toad. No big deal. It's just a flesh wound. I'll be, I'll be fine. Oh. No. What? What? What even happened there? I just suddenly started running and I didn't even double tap. Got it. Oh. You're not getting that second shot of me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Cheating death right there, I swear. Oh, 
Oh, no, 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 no. If you, if you mash the controllers, you can shake those things off, but good luck trying to. If you can even make it to this section. I don't even know, I don't, I don't know many players that can actually get this far without using infinite lives. <laughs> I'm impressed that I was able to do the surfing stage in one life, though, because when I was doing a practice run for this, it was always the surfing stage that got me for some reason. Like, the boss gave me some trouble, but I did just fine today. Again, totally fine, because I didn't jump to make the screen go up just yet. Oh god. Oh god, go away. Okay, come on. Frickin'. No. Goop. Goop, do not be a goop. I said don't be a goop! Uh, yeah, this, this is the state that broke me the first time that I played Battletoads. Because I knew how to get pretty far in the game, but I didn't know what to do with this part because it's always broke me insane! And you guys are probably getting sick of watching this though, so, uh... Steve! You there? Yeah, you and your red Times New Roman text. Uh, I need you to do me a favor. Put on... Little Slugger Extended Cuts, um, copyright, okay. Uh, yeah, go for it. There we go, that sounds much better already. Thanks, Steve. Yeah, Steve is my editor. Don't judge, he's just a Steve. He just does what Steves do. You know I love you, Steve. You're like a brother to me. No, 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 no. Yeah, they will throw them into the ceiling. They're about to kill them. I like it when I freaking kill things. Oh. Oh, we're going up in the world. Very slightly, but we're going up in the world. Because we just hit the next checkpoint. Ow. Well, good thing I made it to that checkpoint, am I right? Yeah, Steve, you can turn off the music now. that part because the gas is instant kill if it hits you. Sorry, I went quiet for, the, for a second. I just went into super freaking concentration mode. Because super freaking concentration mode, pretty freaking helpful when you're going through these games. Oh. Ah, fan. Yeah. The first fan that you saw in the earlier part, they blow you. This one sucks you. Don't take that out of context. Steve, give you a mental note to rename this episode. Don't take that out of context. Yeah. Yeah, thanks. to stop sucking. I know that's kind of hard because the fans SUCK! Ow! Getting sucked into a fan and 
shredded to pieces. Good thing they couldn't like show the details of that, but jeez, that's gotta be like the most painful death ever. Come on. Oh, thanks for that, fan. I wouldn't normally help. You. I wouldn't normally say thank you, but in that case, I'll I'll take it. Got it. Jump. You're not Mega Man, but I need you to jump anyway. Freaking mess it up. Uh, uh, uh. Oh! <laughs> Darn it. Where things start to get. No! Ah! I shouldn't have done that. This is going to take forever. Oh. Ha. Nice try, fans. You can't suck me there. Whether or not you suck me up here, it's... Not going to happen, because I just decided to run off the edge like an idiot. Gas. Blow me. Don't ever take what I say in context, out of context. Whoop. Yeah, I know, Steve. I'm so I'm sorry that I can't really do anything here. But it just I gotta focus. Ah. Okay, screw it, Steve. You know what to do? Yeah, do it. Okay, and we're back. Oh, oh god. Don't let the game beat me. And there we go! On to the boss! There we go. This is the stage 8 boss. You can combo him by just pounding on him while he's in the air. Though if you get hit by him while he's jumping, he'll instantly flatten you and kill you. So watch.
Come on, let's show this guy who's boss. Come on. Ah, oh, fighting again. Luckily, you respawn with, with the boss's damage still done to him, so... There's nothing that I have to, look, to worry about here. I just gotta keep wailing on him. Eventually, I'll win. It's like driving your head into a stone wall. It may seem stupid at first, but eventually, it should work. Keep or should. Steve, I did not need your interruptions about that. Come on. We are so close. I can taste the victory. Tastes like frog soup, which makes no sense because these are toads, not frogs. Whatever. You get more heat. Don't give him the. Yeah! There we go. That is stage eight done. Well, well, well. Fancy seeing you here. What an unpleasant surprise. Go through the steel spaghetti toads and watch out for booby traps. Level nine, the Terra tubes. Now listening to most epic pause music ever, I think we're gonna end this off here. Next time on Let's Play Battle Toads, we will enter stage nine Terra tubes and hopefully break it. See you guys then.